Hi everyone and welcome to Simple Fresh Flavors with Emily. So around this time of year, every year, everybody starts getting really geared up with this pumpkin spice thing. But I live in the Southeast and it's still hot here. I mean, we're like in the 80s today and it's actually a welcome relief. So I thought, why not do a cool pumpkin spice whip? This can be used as a spread, it can be used as a dip, it can be used just on a cheese board. Really versatile, easy to make. So let's get started. Add one can of pumpkin to a large mixing bowl. Get the pumpkin puree. You don't want the pumpkin pie filling. To the pumpkin, add one teaspoon of pumpkin pie spice, one teaspoon of vanilla, and one package of dry butterscotch pudding. You could also use vanilla. Mix the ingredients well to combine. Gently fold and stir in one container of Cool Whip topping. Okay, so you see how easy that was. It was five minutes, four ingredients, and you're done. You have something that is unique and easy to make. So I have here several ways that we could try this. Um, first, I'm gonna try, I have sliced up here a gala apple, put some cinnamon sugar on it, accompanied with some oranges. Let's see how this tastes. It's very good. You have the cool whip topping with, you know, sort of a, the warm flavor of the butterscotch and the vanilla. You could just freeze this by itself and serve it in little mini individual dishes. Mm. Very good. So obviously in lieu of syrup, maple syrup, because you wouldn't, that would be way too much sugar. It's got, you know, it adds a nice little flavor combination, something different. You have guests for Thanksgiving. You could serve this, you know, Thanksgiving morning if you really wanted pumpkin spice overload. Um, any sort of holiday brunch, Oktoberfest, anything. So I hope that you try this out. If you like what you saw today, go ahead and give me a thumbs up and a follow for more simple, fresh flavors. Bye, y'all.